Hello and welcome to the tutorial on learning numbers. In this tutorial we're going to learn about different units with numbers up to 10 million. Okay, we're going to start by writing down a number and then we're going to work through the different units it has. So we'll start over here. Okay, so that is our number. Let's practice reading it first. It is 4,685,391. 4,685,391. Okay, we're now going to work through different parts of this number. Now the question you may face is something like how many hundreds are there? How many hundreds are there in this number? Which digit represents hundreds? It's two from the right. I'm just going to label it. There's no need to work this out. I mean you know this. We've done this many many times before. There are three hundreds in this number. Suppose the next one it says how many ten thousands are there in this number? How many ten thousands are there? Which column represents ten thousands? Well, the thousands are, I'll just, uh, actually well, I'll stick with the same color. These are the thousands and the ten thousands are this one here. Ten thousands. There are eight ten thousands. Okay, suppose the question asks, how many millions are there? How many millions are there in this number? Well, we know this, the millions comes after two commas. We've got one comma here, another comma over here. So this must be the millions. How many are there? There are four. There are four millions. Okay, and the next one is, suppose the question was, how many tens are there? How many tens are there in this number? Now you know this, we've done this many times before. The tens are here, it's one digit to the left. There are nine tens. Okay, the next one is, suppose the question asked, how many thousands are there? How many thousands are there in this number? Well, we know this. The thousands come immediately to the left of the first comma. This is the first comma, and this one must be the thousands. There are five thousands. Okay, now suppose the next question is, how many hundred? thousands are there. How many hundred thousands are there in this number? Well, we know the first comma and we know that this is the thousands, the hundred thousands is to the left. So we've got hundred thousands, ten thousands and thousands. How many hundred thousands are there? There are six hundred thousands. And lastly, how many units are there? How many units are there in this number? Well, we know which one the unit is. It's over here. There is only one unit in this number. And that is how to break down the units of a large number. Go through it step by step. Quite often, what you may face is the question gives you some of these and then you have to write the number down. If one of these is zero or it's not mentioned that means it must be zero so write a zero down. Okay the units is very simple. 